Virgo, this is your forecast for the month of September 2017. If you have visited me before, I'd like to thank you for returning, and if you are new, welcome to my channel. This is a general reading for Virgo Sun, Virgo Rising, or Virgo Moon. It might also be helpful for you to watch your rising and moon sign as well. You can join me on Facebook and Instagram for daily insights on tarot and astrology as well as my pay-per-view channel, vimeo.com slash thealchemistastrologer, where you can find on-demand pages concerning love, finance, and other readings. Now, the underlying energy is this Emperor card. So, you are either on the back end or the front end of a very stressful situation where there may have been quite a few demands put upon you. Now, some of this may connect to a father figure. It could be a husband. It could be uh, your boss. It could be your company. It could be the government. Uh, whatever it is, this is you know, a person who holds some power, somebody who's in a high position, they, they have a title, they're important, they may own land, they're in charge, uh, could be a business owner. For some of you, this is an Aries individual. But the focus during this month is about order and control, you know, stabilizing something, pulling uh, order and form out of chaos. So some of you, you know, maybe you're dealing with authority or maybe you're acting as authority. But this is going to be a month of asserting yourself, driving yourself to achieve in order to create those structures that are important to your sense of well-being. So you're very uh, ambitious. You're very security minded. You're using your rational thought. Uh, to be a leader, to, to, be, to be your own person. Now, for some of you, this is going to uh, come about as some, the offer will be perhaps a job promotion, uh, an offer of money. Uh, you know, you're, you're trying to set something on firm foundation. So some type of transformation is taking place during this month. And again, you have the opportunity for some changes, for following your dream. And perhaps by making some changes about the way you look and you, what your identity is. Uh, now, if you're using this negatively, if you're feeling trapped, uh, you're being uh, aggressive, uh, maybe you're closing yourself off to opportunities, to possibilities, you're setting the wheel in motion in a negative way, this could be a month where you feel a lack of progress. Uh, it could be that there are some issues where people are just not wanting to grow up or that they're, they're running away from their problems or that there's a lack of control or discipline. Uh, and again, whenever the emperor shows up, there are always issues of power. And how is power being used? Is power being used to lead others in a way that they can find their own power? Or is power being exerted in such a way where somebody's being dominant, where somebody's being exploitative, where they're being a bullier? Uh, so... For some of you, this is about either you're using your power and you're given more authority to make some positive changes, you're claiming your personal power, or you're dealing with a stressful situation where people are abusing their power and perhaps trying to dominate you, or you're simply holding yourself back because there's a lack of confidence, you're suffering from some type of mental blockage, and you're not claiming your power. You, want, you won't assert yourself. Uh, so you're not accepting the authority that's being given to you. Perhaps you're being indecisive or unreliable. You're not opening yourself up to uh, broader thinking and you're being very narrow-minded perhaps even excessively logical because there's a lack of direction. 
And this is also about, you know, for some, not taking into account a situation and you're just focused on enforcing the law rather than the spirit of the law. So again, control is an issue. You're going to feel very strongly this month. Your emotions are going to rise uh, because you want to protect you and yours. And so this is going to be a very intense month where the truth is important and you're going to be hell bent on getting the truth of a situation. Again, you may be asked to take charge of something and you're going to be very direct. It, people are not going to have to guess about how you feel about situations. You're expending a lot of mental energy. You're forceful in your communication and your thinking and you are ready and willing to step up to the plate and take on more demands uh, because you are willing to do what is necessary to provide for yourself. But again, for others of you, you're not taking your control. You're caught up in the negative shadow part of the Knight of Swords and you're pushing, you're being aggressive, you're uh, tempted to try to move things along more quickly than they should and you're creating a lot of problems in the process. So being too intense or being stuck in your thinking, thinking that you have all the answers and that you know what's best and you know what's right, you know, coming off as very self-righteous puts you in the corner by yourself. Uh, so you don't get that social and emotional support that you would have otherwise. Part of this may be that you're just not accepting something. There's some things that you're, you're not in charge of, some things you can't change, some things you're not in control of. And if you can't understand that, then it's going to create some inner turmoil within you, which is going to have an effect on your physical self. So this is a month to beware of how power is being used. Uh, are you being very petty? Are you uh, trying to prove something to somebody by exerting your will and your power over them? Is it necessary for you to rise up by pushing others down? Are you being controlling and demanding? Uh, or are you getting that back from other people? So this is about understanding where your true power lies and also understanding where you don't have power. That's important. So this is a month that focuses on leadership and again, seeking some type of security or stability and a sense of belonging through your decisions. It's also about how much recognition you're getting and how you go about to achieve success. Again, are you stepping on other people in order to climb up that ladder or is that being done to you? So there's something about your situation that's not grounded. It's not on solid footing. Now that could very well be that some events are still unfolding, but there is a definite dilemma that you are facing. Now you have two nights. Some of you are dealing with a legal or a court case involving some money. Uh, others of you, there's just some uncertainty. You know, you've got conflicting emotions. Uh, this is, could be two aspects of yourself. On the one hand, you know, there's some emotions. You want to help the underdog, uh, you, the less fortunate, you know, your understanding. But also the air side, maybe you're being too analytical. Maybe, you know, you want to protect yourself or you feel torn uh, between what you should do. So again, there's a dilemma where you're not making a move or you're uncertain. You're not, uh, you, maybe you don't have the information, uh, but whatever it is, you don't have a long time to act in this situation because something about it, timing is critical for you. You know, this is a, a month where you're going to have to pay attention to the detail specifically because the timing of a situation is critical. And again, it may tie into a court case or getting protection or, you know, again, that confliction 
uh, conflicting mission or being in rivalry with somebody. Uh, and so you have to be careful to keep a balance. You could lose your logic to your emotional self. Uh, and so you could be, you know, very divided and unable to cut through the fog of confusion. Um, it could be that, you know, someone is so overcome with their emotions that they're losing all clarity and giving in to those emotions. Now, maybe you're having some psychic, you know, impression, some psychic communication, but maybe there's just some confusion because somebody doesn't want to face up to the harshness of a reality. By the end of the month, you seem to pull it together towards a more level-headed approach. Uh, you use your own personal power and drive to push some things forward. So this is a prime opportunity for you to exploit a situation, whatever it is. But you have to be wary of becoming a people pleaser and trying to be all things to all people and as a result, making things very difficult for yourself.